हाय गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल होप आप लोग सब अच्छे हो टुडे द टॉपिक इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट इज वेल्ड मेटल वेट कैलकुलेशन वेल्ड मेटल का वेट कैसे निकलना है ए वीडियो ऑलरेडी अपलोडेड वन ईयर बैक बट देयर आर सम कमेंट्स इन माय वीडियोस दैट व्हाट इज द एनफोर्समेंट एरिया व्हाई इट इज नॉट कैलकुलेटेड सो दिस वीडियो इज वेरी हेल्पफुल फॉर देम एंड दिस इज फॉर ऑल पीपल how to calculate the weld area with proper area calculation so please be concentrated from beginning to end then you will get a clear concept please subscribe my channel those are still not subscribed i every tuesday and friday videos i am uploading here so you will not miss out any of these videos if you have subscribed so let's start the subject is weld metal weight calculation so plate length is is 1000 mm and the material density these two things is no we should know before start this calculation this is you can say 8 g per cm cube or or 0.008 gram per mm cube so you can get the area of this formula so let's see here this is your included angle 60 degree this is the length means this is sorry this is the thickness and this is the length of the plate 1000 mm so all dimension here are in mm okay all dimensions are in mm so this is your single b joint so single b joint how you calculate this area weld metal weight so you see here you have to calculate first this three area q p and r so how you have to calculate this q p and r you understand the q from where this taken this is the q up to here and this is p and this is r so understand q p and r see here this is first we have to calculate this area so we have to calculate this area the p p is this length is 20 and this is the 3 you know this is the 3 mm so 3 mm what is this 3 mm you can call root gap so you can call 3 mm this root gap okay so the area of p equal to b into h so how much it is coming 3 into 20 that is 60 mm square so the area of p is 60 mm square so we will we'll get to know now q and r so p you understand now now we will go q and r so this is q and r so one is q this part another is r this part so both are same if you take this one calculate this one q then definitely into 2 will be the area so first we will calculate the q now so how we have to calculate the q so this is y okay this is 18 so 18 mm how you get this one is 18 mm 18 mm is this this is your up to this and after that here this one is 3 mm you can say root face so you have to remove this 3 mm then after that you have to calculate so this is 18 mm this is y so tan 30 equal to y by 18 so tan 30 equal to y by 18 then y equal to tan 30 into 18 so how much it is coming 10.39 will be the this distance 10.39 this length y y is 10.39 now area of q 
plus r so you know the area of triangle area of triangle equal to half into b into h so this is half into b h into h for only q into 2 okay so this is half into b 10.39 into h is 18 okay into 2 so the calculation after calculation it will be there 187.02 mm square so you calculate q r and p this area so q r and p you calculated now the most important is how to calculate the reinforcement area so this is your segment okay this is how much this is 3 mm okay you assume this is 3 mm okay your reinforcement is 3 mm this is 60 degree okay and this one how much it is there 23.78 how it is calculate see here so how you calculate 23.78 see here this is how much 10.39 this is 3 this is 10.39 so to plus plus then it will 23.78 it will be there so this will be 23.78 so understand this is 23.78 this is 3 mm now very important you should know the how to calculate the sector this is your so how to calculate the sector this is your 21 mm so this is 21 mm this is 60 degree and this is is 3 mm so area of sector area of sector how much it is y r square into 60 by 360 why 60 by 360 this is the only 60 degree this is the whole circle is 360 degrees. so if you part like this way so how much segment 1 2 3 4 5 6 so 360 60 by 360 means 1 6 part so 1 6 y r square so if you go 1 6 by r square how much y by 6 into r is 21 square so it will come to 30.937 mm square so understand the area of sector means the full area full area full area of sector is 230.937 and next what we will do we have to remove this triangle so you see here which one you have to remove from here you have to calculate this area if you remove this area then you will get only that part this part only reinforcement area only so you will get only the this reinforcement area this is the you see here this so you have to remove this part so you have to calculate this triangle area so how you have to calculate this triangle area what is the formula the formula is so we'll go the formula now area of triangle so area of triangle is triangle how we have to calculate area of triangle area of triangle equal to half into b into h half into b into h into 2 so half is half into b is how much b is this one 
total 23.78 divided by 2 that is the b 11 point you can get the 89 so 11.89 into h is 18 into 2 this is how much it is coming it is coming 214.02 mm square so we will get now reinforcement area so reinforcement area equal to area of sector minus area of triangle hope you understand this one means total area this is called the sector area and you will remove this triangle area so then you will get the reinforcement area so how much this one reinforcement area area of sector is 230.937 minus 214.02 so this is 16.91 mm square so the reinforcement area is 16.91 mm square the total area how you have to calculate so the total area equal to p plus q plus plus r plus reinforcement area okay now p how much you get p how much so p is 60 q plus r equal to 187.02 this is q plus r plus the reinforcement area how much it is getting now sixteen point nine one seven sixteen point nine one seven so you will get the total here sixty two sixty three point nine three seven mm square so you get the total area now now it is very easy now calculate total volume total volume is total area into length of plate so total area is 263.937 into 1000 so this is 263.937 mm cube is volume now weight weight of weight metal to volume into density so volume into density is so weight of the weight metal equal to volume 263937 into 0 0.0008 gram per mm cube that is coming 2111 gram 2.111 catch Hope you understand the full video from beginning to end and the main thing is the reinforcement area how you calculate. Hope you enjoyed this video. So those people still not subscribe my channel, please subscribe to get this type of regular video and I am uploading the videos every Tuesday, Tuesday and Friday. So please be tuned. So see you soon in the next video. Thanks a lot.